Hey guys, welcome to today's video. So today's gonna be a day in the life of my cat because I did a video on like Meet My Russian Blue, that's her breed, and a lot of you seem to really enjoy that. So we're doing a day in her life, a video dedicated to seeing how this incredible cat um, occupies herself during an average day. And so here, as you can see, she's being woken up by her owner, aka me. And where am I going? Okay, I'm getting her a hairbrush. This is a rare occasion, but I had to do it for the sake of this video because gotta get that quality content. So, she really likes this brush. Um, she's a rather clean cat. She likes to pamper herself. So, the brush seemed to get her out of bed. And as you can see here, she's just getting that groom on uh that's the great thing about cats they just clean themselves so that's kind of nice um yeah then i put it down to see if she would follow but she didn't that's okay anyways after the grooming she did some watching of the outdoors if that's a thing as you can see she's staring very intently and is bothered that i'm recording her she doesn't like being filmed very much, but she puts up with it. And then she saw something very alarming, but that's okay. That's me, excuse my um, <coughs> pimple. Uh, whatever, the video's not about me, it's about her. Anyways, that's me talking to her because, yeah, why not? Um, cats probably can understand you. So that's me petting her, she really likes to be pet. And yeah, she was a little confused why I was sticking this phone in her face for so long. Never got the answer. Anyways, yeah, another angle. Me and her. Best buds. So, we have this thing. Murka is an indoor cat, like a, a completely indoor cat, but she really likes to go outside. So whenever someone goes outside or enters, she gets kind of jealous because she wants to go bask in the sunlight like she's some sort of lizard or something, but she's not. So that's her watching people come and go. Uh, yeah, some shoes. She's just observing, living her life. And here's yet another human candidate coming to brush her. Children aren't exactly the most gentle petters, but she still seems to enjoy it. So here is a little house tour. Uh, she wanted me to show you guys her house. There it is, she has some headphones on her second tier because sometimes she likes to listen to music and there's a belt on the bottom in case her pants are ill-fitting. Anyways, here's some more brushing, uh, very aggressive brushing. She doesn't mind though, don't worry, this is not animal abuse. She likes to be scrubbed and whatever, whatnot. Mm -hmm. Very, very engaging. She really likes to <laughs> put her neck into it. <laughs> Never mind. Anyways, some more petting and some beautiful close-ups of her eyes. Uh, I really personally enjoy her green eyes. And here's some of the paparazzi we have around the household. My brother copies me and tries to make videos just like me. So that's her eating. Here's a little what she eats for lunch sort of thing or just what she eats all the time. She either eats that meow mix grain-free thing or that wellness thing, I don't know. I'm not a pro with cat food. And those are some treats, but this is the holy grail of treats. It's from Whole Foods, so it's like super bougie. She just started getting this, like, I don't know, wet food, do you call it? It's really bougie, she doesn't get that very often. After lunch today, she decided to look out the front door. She was very curious at any uh, Amazon packages arriving. And of course she had to tape, take a nap afterwards because it's hard work watching everyone. She was a little angry though, I don't know why. And after that, she went a little cuckoo. Um, she spotted something that we could not see. Maybe it was some sort of very small bug. So she decided to go investigate since it's her duty to keep us all safe. She's the queen of the household as well as the protector. So there's her climbing up on the wall to save us all. And now she's just walking along, but she jumped off because she got scared. I don't know. And now she's back up there <clears throat> because her journey is unfinished. She has not caught the villain, so she's still looking around very frantically, but she got it, she got it. <clears throat> Excuse me, what is going on? Um, oops, a little... <laughs> she 
isn't as able to execute her jumps anymore. She's getting kind of old. So then she tried to convince us again to let her outside. And this time it was, her convincing was a little more successful because I decided to let her outside. Um, it was a very beautiful summer day, very warm. That's her cautiously going outside to make sure nothing has changed, to make sure there's no danger uh, for any of us outdoors. Uh, these frisbees were not there earlier, so she has to make sure that there's nothing wrong with them. Now, for the best feeling ever, walking into the sunlight. Look at this, that is a face of pure happiness. Amazing. I also quite enjoy walking into the sunlight after being indoors all day stuck on zoom anyways now she was getting a little frisky she usually only stays on that concrete part because we don't usually let her go in the grass but she was feeling a little adventurous look she spotted something i don't know i don't know what is she gonna do what is she gonna do she's oh naughty yeah but she didn't get to go far because we don't want her running off or anything don't want her to get any ideas. The sun is more fun anyways, so here she is just stretching out, maximizing her, uh, what's it called, surface area for maximum sun intake. And yeah, she left though. She didn't like my camera angles. Here's her investigating some other random stuff. And it turns out she just wanted to go in the shade because I guess it was too hot to handle. Um, I brought her brush again for cinematic effects because she seems to do a really good job with providing me with quality content when there's a brush near her. And yeah, so she was she got a little thirsty. My brother keeps this little cup for her in her room with water and she quite enjoys that. Now she's just ch taking a break. Uh, there's a puzzle in her house, so she's just doing that. And then, what's she doing? She's in the kitchen waiting for something. And I guess it's dinner time. Check it out. Today she's getting the bougie thing from Whole Foods. Ooh, jump. And her placemat thing was moved to a very awkward position right in front of the pantry because we were Roomba-ing the house. If you don't know what a Roomba is, it's that little vacuum that rides around everywhere and sucks everything up into it, including clothes and such. Anyways, here she is, finally time to wind down after a long day of doing the same thing she does every single day. Uh, I decided to pet her, so you guys think I'm a good pet owner. I'm just kidding, I am a great cat owner. I really appreciate her. I hope she likes me. She does, don't worry about it. She doesn't know any better. And yeah, we're just having a little quality owner pet time. Scrubbing her, scratching her neck. That's her favorite place to be scratched, like behind her head. And honestly, it's really satisfying to A, pet cats, and B, watch people pet cats. Cause like their fur is so soft. And it's not as silky as it used to be when she was young back in the day, because she's almost, what is she, 14 years old, I think? So she's kind of an old lady, but she's still thriving. And I also really enjoy petting her on the head. If you've never pet a cat, like, on the head between the ears, you're missing out. It's a very calming, satisfying experience. And yeah, there you go very relaxing. I should do a cat ASMR video, that would be fun. Uh, grooming time, I guess. And yeah, that seemed like a good enough break for her. Well, it is now approaching bedtime for her, so she likes to choose a new spot every night. Uh, today she chose to sleep on a bunch of pants, which were for some reason laying on a chair. It was very comfortable, but look how adorable she looks when she's all furry like cats are <laughs> but yeah she was kind of doing some damage to the pants because um whenever she is pet or whenever someone pays attention to her she starts like kneading it with her claws which sometimes isn't the best but anyways yeah that concludes her daily routine a day in my cat's life um, if you guys haven't seen my Meet My Russian Blue video, be sure to check that out because if you liked this, you'll probably like that too. 
And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you guys are notified every time I upload. Um, feel free to comment if you have any interesting cat stories, I always love reading those. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video, bye!